Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, everybody. Good evening, Gilberto, Liliana, Carlos, Daniela, Robert, Andres, hey, Hazel, everyone. Julio. How are you doing today? Thank you, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, we're going to start. Um, this is a class eighteen. Today is July twenty seventh, two thousand twenty three. Welcome everybody. Okay. Um. So we have an ag the agenda for today. We have a lesson objective. We are going to read the email, the one that we worked yesterday. And at the end, we have a conversation, okay? Um, at the end of this class, you will be able to write an email to someone. That is the main purpose, the main objective of the class. Okay, we're going to, we're going to review simple past verbs. Mm -hmm. As you may know, we are studying simple past tenses. Here we have regular and irregular verbs. Um, we're going to classify them in the two categories that one is regular and the other irregular. Okay. I will ask you one by one and you tell me if that is regular or irregular. You're going to tell me also the past tense. Okay. Uh, Gilberto. Yes. Okay. This one, go. Is regular or irregular? Regular. So, first, before we continue, what is the difference between regular and irregular verbs? Someone? And go. Go, uh, pass, uh, simply pass. The majority of the verbs, the regular verbs, uh, ends to um, ed in the past. Mm -hmm. And the irregular change, right? Yes, change. Okay, good. Okay, Gilberto, remember. Estamos hablando de tiempo pasado, okay? Ahorita olvídese de la regla del presente, okay? Que es goes, no. Oh. O estamos hablando del pasado. ¿Cuál es el pasado de go? Do you remember? Go. Uh, went. Went, okay. So, is that regular or irregular? Irregular. Irregular, very good. ¿Por qué? Porque cambia totalmente el verbo. No le agregamos solo ed. Los regulares les, les agregamos ED cuando los convertimos en pasado. Pero los irregulares, they change, ¿ok? Cambian. So, the past is, is right. went. Ok, good. Ok, went. yes. Carlos. Um, Hello, teacher. Yes, the verb to be is regular or irregular. Es irregular, teacher. Irregular. Tell me the past tense of the verb to be. Uh, was. Uh huh. And? Was and where. Was and where. Okay. And good. where. Yes. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Lady. Okay, thank you. Bird decide. Regular or irregular? Regular. 
Okay, it is regular. How do you pronounce the verb in past tense? Decided. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, Liliana. Liliana, are you there? Yes, irregular. Make irregular. Okay, what is the past tense of make? Um, my God. <laughs> Yeah. Someone who, who can help her? Made. Made. Okay, very good. Okay, Julio, <clears throat> the past tense of invent. Um, regular. It is regular, okay. But what is a past tense? How do you pronounce it? I uh, invent invented remember the one that did, that end with ah, t le regamos okay. say it, okay. it, 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 it invented okay good good thank you so much hazel are you available yes i'm here okay what is the past tense of word word work okay how do you pronounce it work Word. Remember, there is a T at the end, okay? Yes. Is this regular or irregular? Regular. Okay, very good. Okay. Uh, Daniela, drink. Is regular or irregular? It's irregular. 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 And what is the past tense? It's drunk. Drunk. Okay, very good. Okay. Um Mauricio, the past tense of eat. Uh eight. Eight. Okay. Irregular, right? Because it changed. Okay. Okay, very good. Rover, the past tense of what? What? What okay is that regular or irregular? It's regular. Regular. Very good. Final song T. T. Letter T. Yeah. Good. Okay. Andres. Regular. Very, it is regular or irregular. And what is the pronunciation of it's the irregular? Word? Irregular. Okay. So. So, so okay, very good. Salvador, what is the past tense of do? Salvador. The do. Mm -hmm. Does. Mm, remember, ¿cuál es el pasado? Das es presente. What? Was. No, ese es del verbo to be. Del do. Del do. I don't remember. It's okay. Big. Did. Okay, remember that. Did. Uh, did. Yes, that is irregular. Okay, Gilberto. What is the past tense of look? Look. Look. Uh -huh. Is that regular or irregular? Gilberto? Do you remember? Está en mute. Okay, someone that can help him? Uh -huh. It's regular. Look. Regular. And the past tense is? Looked. Looked. Mm -hmm, with T at the end. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Carlos. 
what is what is the past tense of buy? Boat. Yeah. Boat. <laughs> it's irregular. Yes, it's irregular in the past tense. Yes. Yes. Um, give me one second, teacher. <laughs> Lady uh, said. Boat. Lady told you. Boat. Boat. I don't know. Boat. Think. Boat. Okay. Okay. Boat. Okay. Here. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Look at this. Bye. Cambridge Dictionary. Uh huh. This is the this is the the present, right? Mm, what is the spelling? Mm -hmm. The the simple past, the past participle of by of by. Okay. Thought. Mm -hmm. Thought. Repeat that. Thought. 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 Teacher, okay. but, but the in past and the past participle is the same um, the, word. The simple past, yes. Some of them, yes. later on, when you when you study that that tense, cuando estudian ese tiempo, Okay. So you are going to realize that son of them are the same, okay, with a uh, past participle, pasado participio, pero algunos cambia totalmente, o sea que los verbos van a tener tres tiempos, okay? Okay. Tienen que aprenderse las, los tres tiempos, tres formas de conjugarlos, okay. spelling and pronunciation, they, they are different. Okay. Okay, but the better form to... To learn in the past is use the you. <laughs> yes. Okay, good. Lady. What is the past tense of write? Ro wrote. Wrote. It means that is? Irregular. Irregular. Okay, good. Liliana. What is the past tense of want? Wow. Regular. Regular. What is the pronunciation of of past yeah. tense? Uh, no. Uh huh. No, no sé, teachers. Okay. ¿Qué dijimos que con qué sonido terminaba cuando terminaba con t? Ah. Id. Id. Okay. Wanted. Wanted. Okay. Wanted. Okay, good. Okay, Rolando, Danilo. What is the past tense of... Mm -hmm. Wash. Sorry, teacher. What is the past tense of this bird? Uh, watch. The past tense, how do you pronounce it? What? It is regular or irregular? It is regular. Regular, okay. What? Okay. What? Okay. What is the difference between them? They are similar. What is the pronunciation? Wash. This is wash. Wash. Okay. Wash. Okay. Wash. This is washed. Okay. Wash it. it is regular Wash. too. Okay. Good. Uh, Juliana, are you there? No. Okay. Julio Aristides. Okay, teacher. Are you there? Yeah. Okay. What is the past tense of run? Run. The same? It's uh, irregular. Irregular. Okay. What is the pronunciation of the past tense? It's um, run. The same? Sorry? It is the same 
pronunciation or, or it changed? No, the, the pronunciation changed. Okay. 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 In the in the simple present is run. Is, uh -huh. run. 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 Okay. Run. That is this is the simple present. Now simple past. Ran. Ran. It's similar. It's similar. Um, uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, it is similar. Very good. Thank you Thank so you. much. Okay. Um uh, Hazel, are you there? Yes. Okay, what is the pronunciation of play? Played. Played. Okay, with D. Okay, Jose Andres. This is regular or irregular? It's a regular teacher. Regular pronunciation of, of... studied. Studied. Okay. Studied. Very good. Good job. Study. 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 Yes. Good job. Yes, in order you can practice. Simon, just the class in, in order you can practice uh, the pronunciation and spelling, that is the that is a way that you can do it. Okay. Uh doing exercises. Okay. Also listening to music. Um. Any video, so that have that had this uh, content that can help you. Okay, perfect. So we're going to continue. Do you remember yesterday we were writing emails to someone in the class? So we're going to continue today with that activity. It says, read the following invitation letter for training and answer the questions below. Here we have an example, okay? Dear colleagues, this is in general. Who wants to help me to read it? This is an invitation for a training. Okay, Andres? Dear college, Center Marsella, Cordiali invites you invites you to the annual accounts training workshop to be held on April 4, 2018. The event will take place at the Grand Hotel. The, the theme for this year workshop is conflict resolution. A professional speaker will be conducting all the workshop. Full participation is appreciated. The program will run from 9 a.m. 9 to 1 p.m. Breakfast and lunch will be provided. Please confirm your attendance to Peter Sals. Um, I don't at, remember how do you at, say at email. J at email dot com by March 15, 2018. Yours, Pete Salas Center, Marsella. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, as you can see, this is an invitation letter for training, okay, to a complete group, okay? So, um, we are going to do, we're going to write a similar invitation, okay, to someone. From yesterday, we were working in that activity, but today we're going to continue, okay? Okay, but first we're going to answer these questions about that reading. Okay, how often does the training take place? According to the reading. Every annual. Mm -hmm. Every year, right? Every year. Every year. Okay. Uh, when is the training? Wh when is the training taking place? 
the date? April 4th. April 4th. April 4th. April 4th. Yeah, 2018. 2018. Okay, good. Uh, who is conducted the workshop or the training? Pete Salas. Peter Salas. No, he is doing the invitation. He is writing the invitation. But who is conducting the workshop? A professional speaker. Uh -huh. Professional speakers. Very good. Okay. What is the topic? What topic for the training held this year? Conflict, conflict resolution. Conflict. Mm -hmm. conflict resolution. Very good. What is the request made at the end of the letter? Full participation. Please confirm. Mm -hmm. Confirm Please. your your confirm. attendance. Okay. Confirm. Very good. Good job. Okay. It means that you are ready to understand readings, right? So the same questions we're going to make when we read uh, the readings that we have, well, the emails that you have sent to your partner, okay? Good. So now we're going to move on. Let me see. What is it? It is here. Here we have it. Let me send it the link to you. Okay, the ones, los que no han enviado todavía una invitación. Okay, remember that is an invitation to a training. Okay, ustedes van a invitar a alguien a un training. So you are going to add all the information where it's going to be when, who will be the speakers, what will be the topic, uh, the date, everything. So you're going to provide that information to your partner. And all the emails that you receive, it could be that you receive more than once, pueden recibir más de uno, you have to reply them, okay? Lo van a contestar. So uh, here we have examples. Okay, let me send the link. So you have the link. You can go. Here we have a, a, a example. For, for example, Robert says, from Robert, okay, from Julio. No, oh, this is to Robert, okay, from Julio. Okay, Julio says, dear Robert, I mean, the bigger. Okay, dear Robert, at this moment, I want to recommend to take the training of first aid because I consider that it's important to know about actions to take in case any laboral accident. You can take the training according to the following plan, okay? That will be Place, Hotel Sheraton, Hall, Las Magnolias, uh, day July 28th, a schedule. It is between 8 a.m. to 12 a.m. Trainer, Ministerio de Trabajo. Uh, at, at the last of your training, you will get accreditation. Okay, okay, that you are a technician. Okay, I hope you take the training, Robert. Best regards. Okay, and Robert already replied. It says, I am, okay, hi, I'm Roberto. Good evening, Julio. Thanks for your invitation. I'm interested at first sight, and I will be there on, on the agreed date. Okay, good. Okay, look at, look at this. There are a lot of invitations. Please reply the invitations that you have and make more invitations the ones that 
Y si usted no ha hecho todavía una invitación, try to do it, okay? And reply the ones that you have. Okay, teacher. Let me see, we have here. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. I will give you 10 minutes to do this. Let me take the attendance in the meantime. Okay, uh, Carlos Ernesto. Present teacher. Cindy. Present Janet. teacher. Okay, Daniela. Lisette. Daniela, I can see you here. Pero no sé si solo está de oyente, pero ajá, no, le, no veo que tengas que solo está de oyente. Hey, wow. Gilberto Benito. No, Robert. Por favor. Ok. Juliana. Liliana, presente, teacher. Ok, Liliana. Uh, Juliana. Ok. Uh, Hazel. Present. José Andrés. Present. Julio. Ay, José, no, no. Julio. Aristides. Me está pegando. Niño. Katy Briseida. Carly y Barry. Tampoco. Lady. Mari Leticia está, sigue de oyente. Mauricio de Jesús. Mauricio. Present teacher. Ok. Uh, Robert Carlos. Roberto Carlos. Present teacher. Rolando Danilo. Oh. Present Salvador. teacher. Ok. Salvador Alberto. Salvador. Present. Ok, thank you. Silvia Estela. Silvia. Silvia is now here. Okay. No. He, okay. Wilber Francisco. Yeah, that's the way there. Wilber. No here. And William Roque. Okay. Guys, uh, ok, bueno, you know, ok, ustedes saben, ustedes sabrán. Ok, um, let me see, let me take note to see who is missing for this participation. I can see someone writing, thank you so much. Okay, remember to reply the emails that you have received, okay? I can see there are a lot of emails there, so you can reply the one that has been sent to you. Mm -hmm. Um, let me see. Termina de escribir, ¿sí? like. Okay, to Robert from Julio. That is the first one. Was very good. 
Okay, all the, all the information has been added there. Remember, you can edit uh, your email if you are missing information, okay? Um, then from Liliana, okay, now to Liliana. Brown Katy says, good time, Liliana. I hope you are well. Through this, I want to recommend a training on the on the water low since it can be very important since you work in the area. If you are interested, you can write me. Okay, but it is missing information here, like uh, where, when, okay, and who will be the speaker who will provide that training. Uh-huh. Please confirm the information there, Kathy. Okay, from Kathy to Rolando. Okay, let me see, to Gilberto, from Liliana. Hello, Gilberto. I'm here by contacting you to inform you that we already have your order. Or then, we already have you, your order, your order, maybe. And your, your order in, and we will that we'll, we will the deliver it to you this coming Friday. Mm. No, Liliana, but this is an invitation for a training. No, it's, it's not about an order. Okay, remember that. So, order then. Es una invitación a un training. No es una, no es una orden. Okay. Okay. Try to change. Okay. Look at the examples that I have been reading. The one from um. Yeah, the one from Robert and Julio. From Julio to Robert. Okay. That is uh doing an invitation. Is requesting like uh, the attendance to a training. There is the information, okay? That is what you are trying to do, okay? An invitation for a training. Okay. Uh... Let me see from Katy to Rola to Katy. From Rolando, okay, dear Kathy, I'm writing you this email. I'm writing you this email. Send you. Okay, it's not necessary. Send you, okay. I'm writing this email to let you know maybe you are invited to a training last week. No, next week, okay. Porque tiene que ser en el futuro next week because it's important for you but you don't oh no you were invited training last week because it's important for you 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 didn't go you don't went no you didn't go i hope you can arrive at the training this week okay okay i understand you're trying to use past tense that was good Okay, but you didn't go, usted no fue, okay? I hope you can, you can uh, arrive or you can go, puedes ir, at the, uh, at the training this week. It is, the, okay, the topic, tra the training topic is an employee security co control of the company. Mm, okay, the training will be about security control in the company, okay? 
The day will be April the 20th, the schedule between 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. Place, Hotel Gold Street. Okay. Okay, it's missing here like a, a greeting. Okay, una despedida, un saludo de despedida. Okay. Try to do it. Try to do it there, okay? Okay, teacher. <laughs> Uh, and try to use like uh, organizations, okay? Traten de ordenar sus ideas. I know that you have a lot of ideas, but try to organize them, okay? Porque estamos, estamos fallando en eso, en la organización de ideas, okay? Let me see. Okay, to Rolando from Gilberto. I'm writing this email to you because I want to, to recommend a training, okay? Customer service, okay, about customer service. Did you very important for the company? Mm, did you, it's like a, you are asking a question, okay? But you are not asking a question here. You are giving information. Se le está dando información, no le está haciendo preguntas. Okay. So, will be, it is very important for the company, okay? Or for you, okay? Uh, it is missing the information here, like uh, when, where, and uh, the, the schedule hours, okay? Okay. Let me see this other one. Okay, from Silvia to Gerardo. I ha Hi, Gerardo, there was a problem with my computer. I was starting the bad ones too hard to know. Now, it's an invitation for a training, okay? It's not a problem with the computer. It is an invitation. Um. Let me see here from an to Andres from Cindy, okay? How was your weekend? I have a wonderful weekend setting up the shooting range for the new body ward. For, that, for what I want to invite you so that this coming Saturday, you can participate in our shooting practice where the first point will always be the theory and the and the parts of the weapon and then you will be able to practice the shooting range. But the most important thing is that you must follow the, the instructor rules because in the last shooting practice, one of the body, body guard, um, or bodyguard, Try to shoot the weapon with one hand and then broke it. <laughs> is that for real? <laughs> that is the real life. <laughs> oh my God. Please, I just hope you can go since it's very important. Okay. It's missing the information like uh, the date. Mm -hmm. um, in the in the beginning teacher said that it is in, on Saturday mm. uh, yeah oh that, this coming one. Saturday okay it's coming Saturday yes and the place mm, yes teacher uh-huh <laughs> I'm going okay. to I'm going to add this part okay this is very important Okay, remember guys, punctuation is important, okay? Uh, no veo, bueno, I understand that it is your, like your first uh, um, writings, but we need to use punctuation, okay? Como por ejemplo, punto, okay? Se saber separar una oración, okay? Uh, cuando vamos a usar una coma, cuando termina una oración, todo eso, okay? It is important to develop your ideas. Es muy importante la puntuación. 
para hacer entender qué está diciendo o la idea principal de lo que usted quiere decir eh, para como no confundir a las personas cuando están leyendo. Como por ejemplo, um, these are called running sentences when you don't have punctuations. It's like a US star, like a and you don't have like a post so you don't have a pause okay so in, in, in Spanish you know right how how to use punctuations como utilizar los puntos comas y todo eso okay so it is, it is the same in another language so you need to use punctuation okay that is really important Puntuación ahí, ¿ok? Uh, let me see. From Carlos. Ok, to Carlos. From Hazel. Ok. Good morning, dear Carlos. Uh -huh. I refer to the annual training. Um, I recommend, ok. I recommend to you the annual training on, co on customer service, which will be developed in three models, okay, of eight hours each. I share the details for your re re registration below, okay? Dates, uh -huh, August 8, 9, and 10th, 2023, uh -huh, location Marriott Hotel, coach, to T Forland, a schedule from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay. We can of uh, on your punctual participation and it can be useful for the daily management. Teacher, how, okay. how do I respond to an invitation? Okay, you can respond. It depends of, of your answer. You see if you go or not, you can say um hi uh for example that is kathy hi kathy i received your invitation thank you so much i really appreciate it um yes i i would like to <clears throat> i would like to attend the training i will be there greetings or if you don't have time to go or you don't want to go you can say uh So the same, right? You can, uh, pues, pero, uh, iniciando a saludar, okay? Saying thank you so much for the invitation. And then at the end, you can say, uh, I'm really sorry, but I cannot attend the training because uh, I have busy days, okay? Or, or you can say, I have to attend a different training that I have. So any excuse, right? So, that, but you're saying that, You cannot go, but in a polite way. Una forma educada, okay? Uh, so try to reply in one post, okay? Un reply, o sea, no hagan como pequeños, um, pequeñas respuestas, sino así, como lo he hecho... Who replied this? That was from Robert to to Robert. I don't know. It's para Robert, pero no 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 puso. Ah, from Carlos. Okay, Carlos here. Okay, good evening, Mr. Susanna. Thanks for your invitation. I would like to attend the seminar. I hope to meet you and appreciate your invitation. Uh -huh. Have a nice night, Mr. Susanna. Regards. Okay, very good. That is a good response. Okay, let me see. It says... Uh, dear Robert, uh, first I want to introduce myself, Carlos. Uh, I am Carlos Arsenio, the senior accountant manager. Account manager. I'm writing this letter to you to invite you to our upcoming four, four days, okay, plural, optional training program for all sales department employees. This training program is designed um, 
is signing toward inculcating additional selling skills and strategies among the sales team and hope that you would be paying attention to it. Uh -huh. Okay. This training program also included a marketing seminar for the participants. Here are the details of the training program, okay? Duration, duration two days, Friday and Saturday. Dates are 15 and 16 August. Timing from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay, the training coach Alejandro Contreras, looking forward to your training application. Or your training uh, attendance. Thank you so much for your, uh-huh, okay, very good. That was a good example, Carlos. Okay, teacher, thank you. Okay, from Murcia, from Mauricio, oh, sorry, so from Mauricio to Rolando, dear Rolando, according to our last meeting, we have, aquí, aquí no es necesario to, we have, we had in the past, right? In the Department of Human Resources, punto, ahí, you need, you need required a training you need to take maybe, okay? To, you need to take a training for the personnel to the area of customer service because there are many clients dissatisfied with with our service. My best regard. Okay, it's missing information like uh, when will be the training, location, and it's scheduled. And yes. We try to add that information and that is missing. Okay, Kathy. Um, okay, is missing the, the final uh greeting here. Saludo final. Okay, from Lady to Liliana. Hello, Lilian. I would like to invite you to a leadership training. I will share the details of the training with you. Okay, is the information here, the day, the location, the schedule. The topic will be leadership. Okay, I will look forward to see you at the training. Please confirm attendance. Okay, good. Best regards, see you soon. Okay. Try to answer that, Liliana. from Salvador to Silvia. Salvador is missing their information. Um, from, okay, to Julia from Robert. That is the one. Teacher, creo que a mí me hizo falta subir más información, vea. Yes. Try to add more, the, like, the, the specific details of the training, okay? Okay, I'm writing you this email because I think it is very important. Pero no recibí contestación alguna ni de Salvador. Okay. Um, yes, but if, if that is missing information, okay, try to complete it. Trate de completarlo, okay? Okay. In this moment? Yes, please. We're going through in our country earthquakes and rains in the society to know how help our co-workers. Okay, Robert is missing his uh, punctuation here, Robert. Trata de separar las, las ideas, las oraciones, okay? Sabemos identificar okay. una oración, sí. Entonces, cada oración va dividida por puntos, okay? 
Teacher, so we are going to answer the email that our partner write for us. Yes, please. Try to answer them. Okay. I remember the last year a colleague had an accident and since not one new first aid, we could not help him. For that reason, I consider it's very important that you know about first aid that a knowledge will help you and you can share it with the with your co-worker as well uh with your friends and family okay try to separate the sentence for example here okay i remember the last year a colleague had an accident punto ahí punto okay uh you can say okay. no not very new okay no one knew about the first aid okay we couldn't help him. Punto, yeah. Punto aquí, okay? And then for that reason, okay. I consider it's very important that you know about first aid. Okay, punto. That knowledge will help you. You can, sh uh, will help you. And you can share that. You can share it with your co-workers as well. Okay. Yo había puesto comas, teacher. Yes, pero recuerden ah. que una coma no es igual que punto, ok. Cuando no, el escribimos... punto se para. Ajá, el se punto para se para. idea y empieza con otra. Correcto. Okay. Acuérdense que en, una, en un párrafo, en cualquier reading, ok, siempre vamos a tener puntos en, en todos los... Eh, Todas las lecturas siempre van a haber puntos que separan las ideas, aunque puede haber una continuación, ¿ok? De la misma idea, pero eh, separado por puntos. Algunas veces sí necesitamos comas cuando, tenem, cuando, cuando tenemos, por ejemplo, dos oraciones. Una depende de la otra, como que una es eh, dependiente y la otra es independiente. Necesitamos una coma. Okay, but we need to identify when we're going to use a, a period or commas. Okay, okay. I get it. Okay. Let me see. From Cindy to Andres. Okay, dear Jose Martinez, the reason for this email is because I want to recommend the free state training. Uh -huh. Ok, uh, tratemos como usar mi, las mismas palabras, aquí ya usamos because, aquí ya podemos usar otra, ok, o so, simplemente un punto, ok, and then there are uh, many accidents inside or in outside the workplace, ok, that is the reason why we, we, we want to give you this training, this is a pleasure for, for our team, to invite you, uh -huh. be careful with spelling, okay, and capitalization. Aquí, aquí no es necesario capital letter because we don't have a period here, okay? It is a pleasure, spelling here, uh -huh. la S va después del I, it is a pleasure for our team to invite you to the first eight meetings. Okay, training that are held in the meeting room. They remain attentive. They remain attentive to any question that you have, Mr. Martinez. Okay, if you have questions, you can say here. If you have questions, please let us know. Let me know. Okay, best regard. But try to... Use punctuation, okay? And also complete ideas. Okay, the main purpose, o mi, mi principal objetivo, como les decía, es que ustedes 
aprendan okay, a desarrollar su writing skill. Es muy importante. If you are going to use English for a job, any job, okay, en cualquier trabajo que ustedes eh, tengan y usen este idioma, so you have to write. Tienen que escribir siempre. Porque si usted trabaja, um, por ejemplo, customer service. Usted quiere trabajar customer service. So, you are going to speak with the customer and also you are going to make a report. Okay? Van a hacer como un reporte de la razón por la cual usted habló con ese customer. Ahí se necesita que usted tenga writing skills because you are going to um, you're going to save your records, okay? Van a, van a, a guardar el record de la conversación que usted tuvo con esa persona. Y todo eso va guardado. Por lo tanto, you need to have good writing skills para que los demás entiendan que usted habló con esa persona, qué resolución le dio, um, para que no hayan confusiones, ¿ok? And remember, you are evaluated. Siempre son evaluados de todo el trabajo que se hace. Okay, but you are doing a, doing a good job, okay? Um, we are going to continue later at the end of the class. Vamos a regresar aquí. We are going to continue in a different activity. Okay, vamos a continuar en otra actividad. Uh, then we're going to read it. Después vamos a leerlo. Cada quien va a leer su correo. Okay, exchange email. We know with two classmates email. I respond to each. No, that will be at the end. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, but I need that you reply the email okay in order to do this activity because we're going to create five questions okay about the email that we receive similar to the questions that we have here do you remember this similares a estas preguntas for example how often does this training take place when is the training taking place who is conducting the, the workshop uh, what's the topic for the training, okay? And what is the request made, okay, at the end of the letter? We are going to create questions about your emails, like this. Who already finished? Uh -huh. Please let me know. Quien ya terminó de escribir y ya respondió? Me teacher, I received okay. two emails, email of Julio and Carlos. Julio and Carlos, okay. Try to write the questions. Trate de escribir um, five questions for each email and that you are going to answer, okay? The information, the most important information about yes. the email. Correct. Thanks, teacher. Like the example that we uh, review before. Como las preguntas que hicimos, que, que, es, que um, revisamos del, de la lectura anterior. Okay? okay? Similar. Let me see. I will call by one, one by one to see if you already work on it. Let me see. Uh, lady, how many emails did you receive? Ninguno. Okay. So you sent to Liliana, but you didn't receive any? Let me see. No, ninguno. Mm. 
Viviana didn't reply to you? No? Okay. Okay, no problem. So try to write the questions according to your email, the one that you sent to Liliana. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Liliana? Okay. Liliana, so you have to reply, lady. Okay, tiene que responderle a Lady. Gilberto already replied your email. Yes, teacher. Yes, Liliana already replied your email, right? No, no, no. She Is sent an email to you. I can see Liliana sent the email to Gilberto and you already replied Gilberto? Yes. Okay. Okay. So Gilberto tried to make five questions about the email that you received from Liliana. Liliana, uh, you received just from Lady or did you receive from someone else? También le contesta Katy. También le contesta Lady también el correo de Yes, please. Okay. And try to write five questions, okay? About the emails that you receive, Liliana. You received two emails. Okay, uh, Gilberto. How many emails did you receive? Uh, yes, the Roland. Rolando. Okay, from from Liliana also you receive one, Gilberto. That you already reply and from Rolando, you said, right? Rolando. Okay, from Rolando. Mm -hmm. Okay, but it's still missing information. The one from Rolando. Okay, Gilberto. You receive two emails. Try to write uh, five questions, okay? About the information that you receive in the emails. Okay. Yes. And then we're going to answer according to the email. Okay, let me see. Carlos, how many emails did you, did you receive? Um, uh, I think it's only one. The one from Hazel? Yes. Um, maybe two. I think that Robert uh, sent me. I would imagine that. Robert uh, sent also. Let me see. I think. Let me see. I don't know. I think that's. Mm -hmm. Or maybe only only Hazel. I am only answered the email to Carlos to me. Oh, yes, you yes, just yes. you reply the one that he sent to you, right? Yes, of yes. course. Okay. Oh. So in that case, just one from Hazel. Okay. Yes. Okay. Try to reply that email, or did you reply it already? Um, oh, okay. You already did that. Okay, no problem. So, oh, yeah. write five questions related to the information that you have in the email, and then you're going to answer them according to the information that is in the email, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. Who else? Jose Andres? How many in emails did you receive? One teacher from Cindy. From Cindy. So I have to make five questions from my email or from the email that Cindy sent me? 
from the email that you received from Cindy. Okay. Okay. Is uh, with the uh, uh, with the email I received. Um, I need to resend this email with the question, teacher. No. No, in this case, you reply the email, okay? Solo contestan el email ahí. In the, in the email? Uh, yes. Just I reply. Reply, yes. And... With the, question, with the question. No. Just reply the email saying if you will attend the training or not. Van a, van a reply, van a contestar diciendo si van a, van a ir o no. Okay. And in your notebook, en su libreta de, de apuntes, I guess you have one. So you are going to create the questions like okay. this, como okay. estas. Okay? Yeah. For Thank example, you. how how often does the training take place? When is the training taking place? Who is conducting the training? What is the topic in the training? What is uh, the request made at the end of the letter, at the end of the email? Any other question that you may consider important, okay? And you are going to reply that with the same information that you have in the email. ¿Sí me doy a entender? Van a ser cinco preguntas basados en la información que usted recibió. Okay en el email. Teacher, for example, when is the day of training? Uh -huh, that is one. When is the day of training? Okay. Okay, basados en la información que usted recibe en el email o en los emails que recibió, eh, basado en esa información va a ser las preguntas. Okay? And then you are going to reply the, the answers with the information that you have. Okay, so Andres, you said that you received one. Okay. Uh, Hazel, are you there? Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Sorry, Carlos. Excuse me, where are, uh, where we are going to write uh, this question? In your notebook. In... Ah, okay. Cuaderno. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. No las escriban aquí. Yo solo se las voy a preguntar y las vamos a responder de acuerdo al email que usted recibió. Okay, good. Okay. Uh, yes, I'm sorry. Uh, Hazel. Hazel, right? Uh, yes. How many emails did you receive? No, just the answer of Carlos. Oh, just the answer? You didn't receive any? No. Nope. Okay, in that case, work based on your email, the one that you sent. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. Carla está de oyente. Silvia, Estela, are you there, Silvia? Miss. Yes. Este, quería ver si estaban bien las preguntas que había hecho. Mm, okay. ¿Cuántos? How many emails did you receive, Silvia? Just... No, soy lady. Oh, lady. Perdón, 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 perdón. Usted me dijo que la cambiara. Okay, un momento, lady. Okay, to Silvia from Salvador, okay. Uh, Silvia, you received this from Salvador, this email, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Sería, I want to recommend training power. Business intelligent to monitor productivity in a um, short uh, to view in analysis in the that of the of diet in engage out the cost and renew compress in the same place. No, oh, but this is the one that you receive from yes. Salvador. Uh -huh. Y será que me equivoqué en algo ahí? This is the reply. Eso fue lo que usted respondió. Mm -hmm. Sí, teacher. Hi, Salvador. How are you? My recommend, uh, my recommend first to make a slide skate. Era lo que había preguntado ayer. Entonces se respondió segundo de ayer. Pero como me dijo que lo cambiara. No, pero es que eh, aquí 
Salvador lo que tenía que hacer era agregarle más información a usted, okay? Like the details about the training, okay? He said, I want to recommend the training in power business intelligence to monitor productivity in the dashboard to view analyzing the data and gate in the gate out the cost and renew capacity. Uh -huh. Okay, this is the information basically about what is the training going uh topic. Okay, Salvador is missing here information about this training. Ah, okay, okay. So in this case, you need to answer if you if you will attend the training or not. Okay, if you are interested. Okay, if you are interested in the training or not. Si usted está interesado en ir al training or no. Okay, here you don't have to give more information to him. Just saying, yes, uh, I would like to go. Please let me know more details. When will be the training? Where will, where it will take place? Information like that, okay? You can change this. Puede cambiar esto. Okay? Puede editarlo. Okay, teaching. Okay, uh, let me see. Okay. And then try to make questions about this, okay? Trate de hacer más preguntas. Trate de hacerle cinco preguntas. Pero si usted no recibió otro, you can use your email. ¿A quién le envió usted? Uh, ¿A quién uh -huh. le envió su email? Te lo envié a Salvador. Okay, let me see. No, aquí dice from Silvia to Gerardo. Se lo mandó a Gerardo. Pero este, ah, le dije que este no era válido porque era un, no era una invitación a trading, era algo diferente. Entonces lo voy a borrar. Ajá, por eso lo cambié. Ajá, por eso lo cambié. Ok. Eh, where is it? ¿Dónde está? Porque no lo encuentro. Híjole, no sé, se perdió, pero ahí está. I'm teacher, I'm finished, but I just can find or I just can make four questions. Four questions. Okay, no problem. Uh, I don't see it. No lo veo, Silvia. Y esta respuesta, esta respuesta tiene que ser distinta, okay? Okay, yo creo que esa respuesta estaba por lo que había eh, anteriormente preguntado. Okay, bueno, entonces se la voy a borrar. Just try to reply if you will attend the training or not. Okay. Aquí, hágale las cinco preguntas que usted quiere hacerle a Salvador. No importa que la información no esté, but you want to know information about okay. the training, okay? Okay. okay. Uh... okay. So if you are ready, we can start. Si están listos, vamos a comenzar. Y quien no las tenga, um, teacher, give me a give couple minutes, time. please. Okay, more time. Okay, no problem. Yes, couple minutes. Okay. It's okay. You can. I will give you five minutes more. Okay, five minutes. Five minutes extra. Okay, let me see. Okay. Uh, Rolando Danilo, how, how many emails did you receive? You received one from Gilberto. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, yes. Try to make questions to Gilberto about this email that you receive, okay? All the questions that you consider that are appropriate. Okay. Incluso si la info no está ahí, mejor, porque usted le va a preguntar a esa persona y se la va a decir en el momento que se las esté preguntando. Ok, okay. teacher. Ok, ok. Ok, let me see. From Cindy to Andrés. Andrés. 
He received one to okay, just from Cindy. Cindy, what about you? How many emails did you receive? Only one teacher. Only Andres. one. From? From Andres. Andres. Okay. Remember to um write the the, the the questions about the email. Yes, Carlos? I think that's done. I'm ready. You're done. The okay. question. Yes. yes. Okay. Me too, teacher. Okay. Good. Daniela, how many emails did you receive? No, teacher. Teacher, y no, como no, yo no, tengo. Katy de Lady, 5 y 5, o divido las preguntas. Mm, no, only 5. You can say, you can ask 2 for one email and 2 on, and the 3 for the other email. Okay? I'm sorry, Daniela. I was just speaking with you. Give me permission to. Yes, Carlos. Give me permission to prepare a cup of coffee. Teacher, it's okay, no problem. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay. Daniela, you said that you receive any? No, teacher, pero yo hice mi, mi email y de mi email estoy sacando las preguntas. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you so much. To whom? ¿A quién se lo envió usted? A nadie, porque no sabía quién enviarte. No, pero ¿a dónde está? Yo no lo veo. Lo... Lo voy a poner ahí. Please. Anybody, okay? Anyone, any classmates. So don't, so don't feel, um, don't feel a chain, a penado to send it, okay? Because this is the activity, okay? Se lo puede enviar a cualquiera, no problem. Okay, Robert, you said that you received two, right? Okay, Mauricio. How many emails did you receive, Mauricio? Mauricio? Oh, no, si está de oyente. Okay. William también está de oyente. Oh, sí, Robert? I received two emails of Carlos and Julio, but I don't found, I don't find the, the email of Carlos. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Pero yo no se lo he borrado. No se lo he borrado. No okay. sé. I remember that I, I read that email. Sí lo leí, ¿verdad? Se lo leí. Sí, sí, sí lo leí. I can see only one in, of, of Julio. Mm -hmm. No problem. So you can work with that one, okay? Only with the, Jul okay. the Julio ones. I'm <laughs> okay, sorry. Thanks, if I delete it, I'm really sorry. I, I, it was not my, it was not my purpose to do it. Okay. Let okay, me no see. problem. Okay, Cindy, are you there? Yes, teacher, okay. Okay, how many, how many emails did you receive, Cindy? Only one, teacher. Only yes. one. Yes. Okay, did you create the questions? Yes, teacher. Okay, and Salvador, are you available? Yes, teacher. Okay, how many emails did you receive? No, no one. No emails? No emails. Oh, uh, really? I can see. Let me see. So I sent email to Sylvia, but no received any. Okay, you sent one to Sylvia, right? Yes. Okay. Based on the information that you have, Salvador, you can create equations. Remember that if you are missing information, you can edit 
puede editarlo y agregarle la información que le falta. Ok. Oh, okay. Add question um, abajo de, de eso. Ok. Below, así dice abajo, okay. below. below. Below this information, okay. you can add more. Le puede agregar la información que le falta, ok. Ahí como el lugar, cuándo, eh, all the information that you consider uh, important. And okay. you can create the equations based your email. Okay, who said teacher? Okay. I don't know who said that. Do you have questions, guys? ¿Alguna pregunta? No? Okay. Katy Briseida, are you there, Katy? Yes. Okay, Katy. How many emails did you receive? Only one. Only one. Did you create the questions? Yes. Okay, good. So it means that we are ready. Estamos listos. We're going to start. Okay. Okay, Robert, you will be the first one. So you said that you received one from Julio, right? Here is the one that you received. And you received one from, from Carlos, but Carlos, I don't know what happened with your email. <laughs> Okay. Excuse I, me, teacher. No sé qué pasó con, con su email. Uh, se creo perdió. Que está abajo. <ríe> no, yo creo oh, que se No me le di a delete, but teacher. <ríe> no. <ríe> ok, but no, no problem. No, abajo está, teacher. Abajo está. Ok, ya vamos a ver. Uh, digamos, en la parte derecha, abajo. No. No ¿Cómo digo en inglés eso, teacher? In the corner right. Uh, yeah, in the... In inferior. Inferior right. Inferior corner. right corner. Uh -huh. Yes. Ah, okay. Or, that is superior yes, is, teacher, es porque I, está arriba. I can, I can see ah, okay. the of Carlos. In the middle. Right. Mm, okay, okay. Good. Okay, Gilbert, uh, digo, Robert... Uh, you can start with the questions that you have from Julio's email. Okay. Uh, number one. Mm -hmm. Question number one. How often does the training take place? Uh, the training is once a year for, for one day. It's once a year. Once a year, uh, okay. Once una a year, año. For, una vez okay. al año por un día. Okay. Um, the email of Carlos. How often does the training take place? Once a year for two days. Once a year is for two days. Okay, good. And number two, when is the training? What is the training taking place? Taking place. Taking play for Julio. The training is in July 20, 28. Okay. And for Carlos, is the training is in August 15 and 16. Okay. Good. And question number three. When, who, who is conducting the worship? Who is for, conducting? Okay, who is conducting the worship mm -hmm. for for Julio? The training coach is by Ministerio de Trabajo. Mm -hmm. and for Carlos, the training coach is Alejandro Contreras. Okay, good. And number four. What is the topic for the training health these uh, this years? Uh, for Julio, the topic is uh, first ID. First aid. First aid. First mm -hmm. aid. And for Carlos, I think, I think so is for, for seminar to skill for sales 
I sells skills. Yeah. Okay. And number five, what is the request made at the end of the letter? I remember uh, for Julio, he he hopes I am attend the the seminar. He hope, okay. He hopes he, you attend the training. The, the, the training, yeah. Mm -hmm. And for Carlos, um, I don't remember, but but it's similar <laughs> because <Okay>. I lost. <laughs> I missing the email. Okay. The <laughs> okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, teacher. Okay, let me refresh this. Maybe uh, I can see the, the trading, the, the ones from Carlos. Porque no lo veo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm missing again. From Carlos. Uh, come on, your, your eraser might work, teacher. No. Let me it's see. Uh, inferior right uh, corner, teacher. Julio Rojas. It's cover. That's, that's, I start the chair. It's under the email with the title, uh, annual year training. Robert. Uh -huh. Oh, it's here. <laughs> yes. It is because Robert. it doesn't have the, the, the name here. Uh -huh. Because it says just to Robert, but it doesn't have front. <laughs> okay, it's, it is here. <laughs> okay, got it. Just sorry. Okay. The final. Good. Finally, <laughs> thank you so much, Robert. Very good, good job. Okay. Thanks, lady. What about you? So you received it from Liliana. Uh, no, yo le hice una Liliana. Ah, yes. Uh -huh. Entonces yo hice unas preguntas eh, de acuerdo a eso. Okay. Uh, how how long do I have to confirm? Uh, can I bring someone else? The training includes food. How many sessions will it will it be? Um, the training has any cost. Okay, so I need the answers for your questions as well. Okay, usted me dice las preguntas y también me dice las respuestas. Okay. And the training has any goals? No, the training no no okay. have a goals. Sorry, in that case will be does the training have any goal? Goal, right? Como de costo, como si hay que pagar. Oh, cost. Por... Okay, and. Uh -huh. Entonces sería, does the training have any cost? Esa sería la pregunta, ¿ok? Remember to use the auxiliaries cuando, cuando hacemos pregunta, ¿ok? Does the training have any cost? Um, What will be the answer? No. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It okay. is for free. Right? Is it for free? Okay. See, it's. It is. Okay. Good. It's. Okay. What is the second question? How long do I have to confirm? When? Cuando? Do I have to confirm? When? Uh, when do uh no when do i have to confirm uh -huh. cuando tengo que confirmar uh, it, okay the the next week next week that is the due date mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. next week okay what will be the other question you have? Can I bring someone else? Mm -hmm. 
can I bring someone else? That is good. What will be the answer? Yes. One person. Okay. One person is allowed. Okay. Next. The training includes includes full. Does the training? Does the training? Okay. Include that... food. Yes. Yes, it, it does. Yes, it, it does. Okay. No, and number five? How many sessions would it be? How many sessions will be? What is the answer? Three, three sessions. Sessions. Three sessions. Okay. Good. That was good. Thank you, lady. Okay. You. Remember to use the auxiliaries. When you are going to ask questions, okay, busquemos la estructura de las preguntas. Así como hemos repasado antes, hemos estudiado antes con el verbo to be y el to do, buscamos la estructura de cómo hacer una pregunta. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Liliana, I need your questions, Liliana, for your email, the email that you received. I la estoy haciendo. <laughs> mm. Okay, I will give you time. La voy a dejar pendiente. Okay, okay, thank you. Gilberto, ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, how many emails did you receive? Two, right? Yes, the Liliana. From Liliana. Let me see what I said. From Gilberto. No. That is the one that you sent. Ya lo perdí otra vez. Juan Gilberto Turlando. Hmm. Okay, here is. Good evening, Gilberto. Uh -huh. Tell me the questions, Gilberto, that you have about this training. Okay. How often, do, how often does the training take place? Uh, does Liliana recon, recon the to mean in place? How often the trading take place? Okay, what is the answer? Uh, does, does Lilian recommend to mean in place? Mm. Mm. No, pero esa no es una respuesta porque me está haciendo como otra pregunta en la respuesta. Sí. Ah, yo le, eh, como ella me, me estaba invitando, ¿verdad? Enseñarme los productos, ¿verdad? Yes, but Pero, you said, um, I'm sorry, you said how often the training often. take place. Está preguntando sí. cada cuánto dan ese training. ¿Cómo sería la respuesta? Ah, oh, ok. The training. Eh. It doesn't have the information there. No tiene aquí la, la información. Si yo leo, no dice. Solo dice que va a ser this coming Friday at 10 a.m. in the morning. It doesn't have like a, it is once a year, it is uh, once a month. No tiene la información. Entonces, Liliana. Answer the question to Gilberto. How often the training take place? Usted me va a decir how often the training take place. How often the training take place? Uh -huh. Liliana, what will be your answer? My, uh, how often does the training take place? Training the place at the Holiday Inn two times the month. 
twice a month. Dos veces al mes. Ah, uh, yes. Uh -huh. Twice a month. Okay, twice. that will be the answer, Gilberto. She said that the training take place twice a month. Dos veces al mes. Okay? Twice a month. Okay. Uh -huh. What is your uh, second question, Gilberto? Uh, when is this training taking place? When? Okay, that answer, yes, is there. When the training is taking place. The training will be this next day. For I did and 10 I am the morning. Okay. Thank you, Liliana. Gilberto, next. Who is conducting the workshops? Who is conducting the training? Is that answer What's there? Workshop, teacher. Uh, workshop is also like a uh, taller, okay? It is so it's similar with the training. Mm. Okay, thank you. Okay, who is conducting the training? Is that information there, Gilberto? Está en el correo? No, verdad? No. Okay, Liliana, answer the question. Who is conducting the training? Um, health and nutrition products. Who? Health and nutrition products. Es que productos de nutrición, de salud. Oh, okay. So, will be, you can say the name of someone, el nombre de alguien. Oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or lie. <laughs> sorry? I'm or sorry? Lie. Or lie. Products for lie. Uh -huh. Ah, perso el nombre de persona. Mm -hmm. Who is ah. Who is conducting the training? ¿Quién va a ser la persona que va a dar el training? Okay. Licenciado Vladimir Castro. Okay. Do you have another question, Gilberto? Yes. What the topic for the training held this year? What is the topic for the training, Liliana? Because that information is not there. That is why it was important. The for life, nutrition. Products for nutrition. Salud nutrition. Health and nutrition. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next question, Gilberto. What is the request made in the end of the letter? ¿Cómo se llama? you like the products? Inscription, que si le gustan, que es, ah, um, me oye, yes, sí, se, um, espérame, lo, este, que si, va, si le damos la capacitación, eh, si le gustan los productos, el temperamento es la peculiaridad e intensidad sí, individual de los amigos. Entonces, ajá, se puede inscribir para vender productos. Okay, so you're you're asking him um if he need more products. I uh, saying here if you need more, okay, okay, pero aquí es be careful with the spelling. If you need information about the product, I guess we look forward to you. Okay, let like uh you are uh, waiting waiting for the answer, okay? Waiting for his response. That is why it was really important to make a good email, okay? Para no estarnos perdiendo con la información, porque si usted hizo un buena, un, un, una, buen, una buena invitación, there we have all the information that we need. 
¿ok? Okay. Ay, teníamos todo en el email, por eso era importante hacerlo completo. Ok, good. Carlos, thank you so much. Uh, Liliana and Gilberto. Carlos, tell me about the email that you received. Uh, okay. Who was the, who your partner? I'm sorry. From Hazel, I received, right? Uh, yes, from, from Hazel. Okay. Uh, the first question is, have. when is the day of training? When is the training? When is date. the day of, or when is the training day? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Okay, teacher. What is the answer? <laughs> Give me one second. When is the training day? Okay, uh the 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 training day it's um August A nine and ten. Okay. Twenty twenty three. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Next question. Okay. Uh what is the coach 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 name? That is the coach name. The coach uh -huh. name, yes. Uh, the coach name is Tutti for Lamb. Okay. Okay, the other one is how often do this training occur? Okay. Uh, training takes place once, once a year. Once a year. Okay. Yes. Um, what is the name of the training? What is the uh, topic? What is the training topic? Uh huh. What is the training topic? Yes. Uh, the name of the training topic is a uh, customer service. Okay. And the last one is how many modules does the training consist of? Uh, there is three modules. Models. Of models, yes. Okay. Good. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. It is easier when you have all the information, right, in the email. That is why it was important to write the complete information. Okay. Thank you so much. Good. Okay. Jose Andres. Tell me about the email that you receive and the questions that you have. My, the email is from Cindy. Mm -hmm. Well, the first question is, I just make four questions. Okay. From the email. And the first, who sent the email? I know that it's basic, but... To send the email, the email sent from Cindy. And the other one, what is the topic of the training? The topic of the training is fear a fear ID, fear AID training. Mm -hmm. um, why Cindy recommend the training? In the recommended training, because there are usually many accidents inside and outside the workplace. And where is the training take place? Um, can you <laughs> put on the quadrant? Is here this one? But my, I can see it. El que está en, en, en como en moradito, este es. No, oh, sorry, teacher. Perdón, la, 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 la. Sorry. Uh, yes. Where is the training take place? The training take place in the, in the meeting room. In the meeting room. Uh-huh. Just four questions. Okay. So, this email, uh... What kind of observations do you have for the email, Andres? What is missing there?
Spelling, right? Tiene le falta spelling, tiene que arreglar el spelling y la puntuación. Oh, yeah. And yes, it's, it's missing more information like the date. Yes. Yes, the uh -huh. date. Yeah, more information. Yeah, the place. The place. Okay. No. The place. Well, the place is there, right? But it's missing like oh, a... Yeah. Uh -huh, the, the specific date or the, the, the training. And uh, let me see what else. And then it's, um, like how often it takes place. Cada cuanto dan as a training. Okay, uh, observations that I had for you, Andres. When you said, why Cindy recommend the training? That is a question, remember. It is a WH question. WH, because it has why. Entonces, ¿qué le falta a esa pregunta? Why para que sea pregunta completa. Why? Why does, does Cindy recommend the training? Ajá. Okay. Uh -huh. Why does Cindy recommend, recommend the training? training? Okay, teacher. Yes. Ajá, le faltaba eso, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. Oh, okay. Ok, igual con el con la primera. Who send the email? ¿Qué le falta a su pregunta? Who send it the email? No. Who does? Who does send the email? Okay. Porque no sabemos si fue she or he. Ajá, yes. Puede ser okay. she or he. Who does send the email? Okay. Who does send the email? Mm -hmm. Yes, try to remember the auxiliaries to make questions, ¿ok? Para hacer preguntas, usamos siempre un auxiliar, entonces tenemos que hacer uso de eso, ¿ok? Good, thank you so much. Ok, now, Rolando. Are you there, Rolando? Sí, teacher. Rolando from Gilberto. Okay, how many emails did you receive? Two. Yes. Or one? Just this one? One, one, one. Okay. One. To Rolando from Gilberto. Okay, I'm writing this email to you because I want to recommend a training customer service. Did you very important? Okay, this email is is missing a lot of information. Okay. Uh the training okay what are the questions that you have from from this email and and Gilberto will answer the questions when you when you make the question if you don't have the answer in the email he are he's going to answer okay what is your first question uh what day will the the train the training be when when does the training take place cuando take place uh -huh. is a is a uh, lugar place yes no is a is a dia what when. day when what? Uh -huh. when is when. cuando okay where is the lugar no 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 what day is when day? When does the training take place? Okay, cuando? When? And where okay. is donde? No. Uh, the question is what day? No, no, I don't know. No es correct. Que día? O algo uh -huh. así. Sí, ya, yeah, día. What día? day? When will What be the training will... date? When? Yeah. 
Uh-huh. When? Yes. When? When is ah, okay. the training date? Okay, when. Uh-huh. When day? When is? When is? The training date. The training day. Ah, okay. What is the answer, Rola, uh, uh, Gilberto? The training for uh, Saturday, the 15th August. Okay, the training is August 15th, Saturday, August yes. 15th. Okay, that is the date, okay? What is the other question that you have, Rolando? Uh, what is uh, about the topic? What is the training topic? The training topic, customer service. Okay. Thank you. Uh, who... Who will get the training? Yes. Uh, who is conduct, conducting Mark, Mr. Marco Sanchez, professional speaker in customer service? Okay. What is the... Thank what? you so much, Gilberto. Uh, what is the correct question? Uh, do you remember that? Here we have it. Who is conducting the training? Okay. Oh, okay. Uh huh. Who is ah, okay, conducting teacher. the training? Okay. Who is conducting? Okay. Um. Next question, Rolando. Uh. What is, what is the training place? Where? Okay, don't where? 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 Aha, uh -huh, where? Where? Perdón, aquí. Where? Where is the training place? Where training place? Your company room. The training will take place in the company room or yes. in the training room. In the training room. In the company training room. Okay, next. Okay, okay. only teacher. Okay. Only that. Yes. yes. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, one more, uno más. Y pasamos a hacer la tarea de hoy. That will be Cindy. The rest will will be for tomorrow. Lo demás para mañana. Cindy, what, are you ready? Yes, teacher, ready. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry? Only three questions. Only three yes. questions. I... Andres. Okay, from Andres to Andres. Okay. Uh -huh. This is the this is the email that you receive. Okay, tell me your questions. Okay, number one. How much experience do you have with shorting training? Mm. But that is one question for you, right? But about the training, la pregunta la vamos a hacer relacionada con el training. Hoy usted le quiere decir, le quiere preguntar cuánta experiencia se necesita para ir a ese training. Uh -huh. Okay. So in that case, how we're going to make that question? Uh -huh. Do I need experience uh -huh. shouting, shouldn't do I need experience shouldn't 
A weapon. Uh huh. That will be the one question. Do you have that question here? Do you have the answer here? Oh, puede ser son experience is needed for training. Do I need experience? Should I, uh, do, do I need? Okay. Necesito experiencia? Se necesita experiencia? Do I need experience during a whip? Shouldn't I whip on? Okay. Mm -hmm. To attend the training? Or you, also you can say, do attendees, okay, los que asistan al training, right? Attendees need experience or previous experience sure in a weapon do attendees need previous experience sure in a weapon okay si los que si las personas que van a asistir al training necesitan experiencia para Okay, disparando un arma. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, what will be the next question? Number two is how many times how you practice shooting? Mm, pero es que esas son preguntas como para él. Yo las quiero relacionadas con el producto. Con el training, ¿ok? Con el tema del training, the place, uh, or the date. No sé si me doy a entender. Sí, entonces puede ser where will the shooting practice take place. Ajá, ok. Where. Okay. Where the shooting practice. Where. Thus, the shooting practice will take place. And finally, what hours will the practice have? How many hours? How many hours will the practice have? How many hours? Um, do we need to practice. Okay, ¿cuántas horas tenemos que practicar? Okay, thank you so much for your questions. And, yes, um, we're going to move on to do the activity number, tenemos dos minutos, la hacemos rapidito. Okay. Tomorrow we're going to continue. The ones that didn't uh, complete it today will be tomorrow. Okay. I was, where, or am in the New York last summer. I was in was. New York last yes. summer. Okay. My dog did be, where, or was, white and black. Uh-huh. Was. 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 Okay. Where. Where. Uh -huh. Was or where. Your brother from. Was. Where. Where. Was. Was. where was your brother? Okay. Where. Was. Was. Okay. Was okay. Okay. No se deciden ustedes. Okay. Our old car. Uh huh. Where or was? Our old was. car. Was. Red. Was. Okay. Uh, where was or are you where? and I? Where? Where, you? where? Where? Where you and I? Go to friends five years ago. Five years ago. Five years ago. <laughs> 
Okay, very good. All of them are correct. Thank you so much. Okay, remember to complete this homework. Okay, we are missing just um 19 and 20. Okay, just two more. And we are done with this. And, and uh, let me see, the final exam will be on Monday, okay? El lunes lo terminamos, hacemos el final. Tomorrow we're going to complete in, uh, homework 19, okay? ¿Y mañana, teacher? Yes, tomorrow. Vamos a completar mañana la 19, okay? La tarea 19. Okay, teacher. Very good, guys. Do you have questions about this? No question. Okay. Tomorrow we're going to practice more about the verb be exercises, okay? About the verb be and, and more regular and irregular uh, verbs, okay? So that is everything for today. Thank you so much for your attendance. And remember to practice every time that you uh, are free. Okay, cada, cada momento que ustedes estén libres, try to practice, ¿ok? Ok, Tenemos... advice, teacher. Okay. ok, see you tomorrow, ¿ok? Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you. Me. Yes, lady. Me permite un ratito. Ok, no problem. Let me see. Es que, este, como ha faltado dos sesiones, ¿verdad? La primera fue porque me enfermé y la de ayer porque pensé que me iba a despertar, pero como me había dormido a las once y media y me había levantado como a las tres y algo, entonces estaba sumamente cansada y no me pude conectar. Pero mañana hay como una actividad de la oficina porque va a haber un cambio de, de quién era directora país, se va y llega alguien más. Entonces, como nosotros no venimos, bueno, sí nos manda, ¿verdad? A, como capacitaciones, formaciones y así. Este, vamos a estar en el evento mañana, pero es en la noche. Entonces, no sé, porque no quiero faltar otra vez. Ok, conectos a de oyente. Igual, o sea, um, para que no pierda asistencia, solo conectese de oyente y solo es un repaso, ¿ok? De lo que hemos visto de la uh, unidad 4. Si usted considera que todavía necesita re repasar más que todo cómo hacer preguntas, en tiempo... Sí, porque olvidé los auxiliares. <ríe> sí, ok. Eh, usted lo puede hacer por sí solito por sí sola, o sea, hay muchos videos de eso, puede buscar en YouTube si necesita que, necesita refrescar un poco más, o puede también ver la clase otra vez, mañana vamos a practicar un poco más cómo hacer preguntas eh, no se preocupe solo quédese de oyente está bien ok, muchas gracias Quédese. ok, good night bye, bye. bye.